being inspired from my Cox Yuki video and also from all the requests that I got from everybody to try to make an electric Yuki. I know they make electric Yukis, but I thought I'd try it myself. First I'll try the Nitroplanes F4 Phantom. I installed a bell crank system uh, to control the elevator and just a receiver uh, so I can control the throttle. Uh, since it's a brushless fan and motor, I have to have a, an electronic speed control for brushless. And uh, I'm going to use my troublesome Spitfire that also needed lots of nose weight and still does, as you will see. So let's take it out and see what happens. You control. What I've done is I'm push rods in here. And the only reason I'm using a radio is for the throttle because I need a ducted fan. Uh, which which has a uh, brushless motor in it, so I need that speed control. So uh, we're going to start with 35 foot lines here first. Just like the real ducted fans, they need a lot of speed to get up and fly, but since there's no wind being blown over the control surfaces, it also stalls when it hits the headwind. This model just does not have enough power. I'm going to uh, turn it back into a RFC. Okay, let's try the Spitfire. Okay, here's what I've done. I've taken my uh, Spitfire and I have placed inside a complete setup to run the push rods. So I have elevator back here and a, I use the same controls. Um, left the servos all in. I'm only using one channel on the radio. That's for the throttle because I'm using a uh, brushless motor and I have to have a speed control to run that. Otherwise, I'd just turn it on wide open. So, um, got a slight amount of right thrust in the rudder. Run on the radio. This is only because I need a throttle, electronic speed control. Put this in here. Put this on. Use this radio for the uh, throttle. Very touchy here. I'm at half throttle here. Slightest bit of elevator 
makes it climb, but uh, it's doing pretty good. I think this would fly on a 60 foot cable is pretty good. It works. <laughs> yes. Uh, okay. Let's put it on the 60 foot stainless steel cables, which I've got on order. So we're going to have to wait actually for the next segment just to see how we'll go and if it'll stun or not. Gosh, I can't wait myself. I want those cables. <laughs>